Hi, I'm David Dodge. Welcome to Green Energy Futures. This week, we present part two of our exclusive interview with Gary Holden, the CEO of Pulse Energy in New Zealand. Something revolutionary is happening in that country. Companies are implementing time-of-use pricing for electricity. The price of electricity changes based on supply and demand. The day is divided into three periods, daytime, evening, and nighttime. Consumers respond to these price differences. If you see an evening price uh, repeatedly, you might invest in LED lights because you want to save money at that evening price. And if you see a daytime price repeatedly, you might want to go and get solar power. And if you have an electric car, you might want to not charge it during the day because the nighttime price is cheaper than the daytime price and you fill up your car with cheap energy. So sending those very simple three price signals drives consumer behavior. When you pay for the actual price of electricity, installing solar with battery storage suddenly becomes good for the pocketbook and good for the grid. The transparency of pricing also helps make energy efficiency worthwhile. Uh, During that five-year period, we watched um, consumer demand on average fall. For example, our own customer base, um, we've watched um, 13% reduction in um, in, in energy consumed per household for people that are getting this, this signal. Once consumers see the actual price of the electricity they're using, they recognize the tremendous value in electric cars. Gary Holden has seen this himself. He drives a BMW i3 electric car. Well, you know, it's funny. I, I, have, a, I have an i3 here in New Zealand, and, and I've had a Volt prior to that. I've been driving electric cars here for five years now, and And so you get a lot of data when you do that. And um, I worked out last year, I I did about 10,000 kilometers on my i3, and it it cost me 150 bucks. In a market with time-of-use electricity pricing, you can choose to charge your car when prices are low. So in other words, if consumers right today choosing nighttime energy to fill their cars are effectively buying oil at eight or nine bucks a barrel, 60% of New Zealanders say they'll buy electric the next time they have a chance to buy a car. In the time it takes to build a giant power plant, Holden says it's now possible to build the equivalent solar and distributed energy, one customer at a time. The big difference is you don't have to build the power plant and you don't require as much transmission and distribution infrastructure. If you... If you have consumers getting the signals to think about solar power or, or LED light conversions or an electric car because they, you know, they like the idea of going 10,000 kilometers for 150 bucks. Solar panels are always getting cheaper. Batteries are always going to be getting cheaper. So the a green energy market for electricity actually is going to just get cheaper. Holden says the economics already work for solar and energy storage and that moving to market-based pricing will also reduce the cost of expanding the grid in the future. We've been speaking with Gary Holden, the CEO of Pulse Energy in New Zealand. Learn more, check out our blog at greenenergyfutures.ca. For Green Energy Futures, I'm David Dodge.